onto the electrochemical series as part of the redox equilibria. So, an electrochemical series is basically just a list of different electrode potentials, all of which are relative to the standard hydrogen electrode half cell. All the electrode potentials are written as reductions, because don't forget they are half equations. The reactant of this half equation is the oxidising agent, because obviously that's what's gained the electrons. And the strongest oxidising agent will be the most positive. The products following on then is the reducing agent, because obviously this is what's lost the electrons. And the strongest reducing agent will be the most negative on the electrochemical series. So what do we use this for though? The electrochemical series is used to predict whether a cell will be feasible. To be feasible, the E cell value must be positive. And to calculate the E cell, we should already know this now, its E cell is equal to the electrode potential of the right hand side minus the electrode potential of the left hand side. The right electrode is the oxidising agent and this will be the more positive electrode potential. The left electrode is the reducing agent and this will be the more negative electrode potential of the two in the cell. And that's it for the electrochemical series.